Apple Music is usually pretty reliable and it's pretty rare you have any kind of technical issues with it. But if you do and it's not working for you, well here's the basic troubleshooting steps you can take, starting off by just resetting the app itself, which can be done in several different ways depending on what platform you're actually using it on. If you use it on the iPhone, which is probably the most common use case, simply just swipe up and hold around the middle of the screen. Or if your iPhone still has a physical home button, double tap on that. That will bring up all of the apps that are currently open, so simply swipe up on the Apple Music app to get rid of it. On Android, you may simply just click on the Apps button to bring up all apps and then once again remove Apple Music in a similar way. But you can also force stop it by going into Settings and then going into your apps. Then find Apple Music from the list and then select Force Stop. That can differ slightly depending on what version of Android you're running from what provider. Then on a Mac, simply just right click on Apple Music in your taskbar or control and click if you're using a trackpad on the Mac Pro instead and then select quit. If the app is so broken and stubborn that that doesn't work, you can go into the activity monitor instead find Apple Music and then force quit it that way. If that still doesn't work, then you may want to restart your device. On phones, be it Apple or Android, it's usually pretty simple. Just long hold on your power button until it tells you that you can shut it down or restart it. After which you do just that and it's going to shut down and fire up again. On Mac, simply just click on the Apple icon in the top left and then hit restart, after which once again the restart process will commence. If it's still not working, then you may want to check if Apple Music is actually down. Now Apple do have a website where you can check the status of pretty much all of the services and if they're currently online or experiencing any outages. So go there and make sure that Apple Music is in fact working. If it's still not working, then the app itself may require an update. So starting off on iPhone, go into the App Store, then click on your profile icon in the top right. Then in the Updates tab, you can see all apps that can currently require an update. So just tap on Update All and it's going to be updated. On Mac, once again open the App Store and go into Updates on the left hand side, which will once again bring up all apps that currently require an update. On Android, simply just go into the Play Store, then tap on your profile icon in the top right. Then go into Manage Apps and an Update All button will also appear. But maybe it isn't the app itself that requires an update. Maybe it is that the operating system of whatever device you're using requires it. So how do you update it? Well, once again, starting on iPhone, head into your settings and then tap onto general. Then tap onto software update. And finally, if there are any, they will show up here and a download and install button will be present at the bottom. On Android, go into your settings and then onto software updates. On Mac, once again, click on the Apple menu in the top left and then head into System Preferences. From there you want to go into General and into Software Update where once again, if there is anything available, it will tell you. If it's still not working, there could be something with your subscription, maybe it hasn't gone through. Now, in order to check that, you usually have to access the Apple Music app itself, but what if you can't access it? You can still do it by going into your iPhone settings and then tapping on your iCloud account photo. Then tap on to subscriptions and then it will tell you if your subscription is valid. If you have the subscription via Google Play instead, simply just go into the Google Play Store. Once again, tap on your profile in the top right and then go on to payments and subscriptions. After that, just go into subscriptions menu and it will tell you the list of active subscriptions you currently have. If it's still not working, you may want to contact Apple support by going over to this link right here, and they may be able to help you further with this, because at that point, it could be a much larger problem, either with your device, or maybe a bug with Apple Music itself. So best just to get in touch, and they will be able to help you from there. But make sure to tell them what troubleshooting steps from this video you did first, so they're all up to date. So that's pretty much everything you can do if Apple Music is playing up. If you found this video helpful, maybe subscribe to How to Authority for more like this in the future.